Angelo Parisi is an Italian-born judo star who has won a total of four Olympic medals, which is more than any other judoka in history, and he has done so while representing both Great Britain and France. Born in the small Italian village of Arpino, halfway between Rome and Naples, Angelo Parisi was just three years old when his family moved to England. Parisi excelled in rugby, helping his school win the national school championship, but he also showed talent in both judo and shot put. Having developed an impressive physique, Angelo realized that his great potential was best displayed in martial arts and at the age of 15 decided to focus entirely on judo, where it took him just 11 months to earn his black belt. Parisi became a four-time English champion and a two-time European junior champion before becoming an English and adult champion three times at both flyweight and heavyweight level. before winning the Inult European Championships three times. At the age of just 19, he was selected to represent Great Britain at the 1972 Munich Olympics. His coaches decided to enter him in the open category, where he was the lightest judoka in the competition. After beating Frenchman Jean-Claude Brandoni in the semifinals, he made it through the qualifying rounds to win the bronze medal, proving too strong for his opponent Douglas Rogers of Canada. In 1974, Parisi married a French woman and moved to the other side of the English Channel. He was unable to compete in the 1976 Games in Montreal, as he was still in the process of obtaining French citizenship. However, Angelo soon claimed the first of six successive European titles under the French flag. Surrounded by the Palace of Culture and Sports in Moscow, site of the 1980 Olympic Judo Games, Parisi was in superb form. On July 27, he won all his heavyweight events by a pawn, but at the same time he saved all his strength for the final against Bulgarian Dimitar Zeprianov, who was a full 40 kilograms heavier than him. Not a minute later, Parisi executed a superb Sioyotoshi, a difficult shoulder throw, and put his opponent on the mat. In doing so, he became the first Frenchman to win Olympic gold in judo just a few days ahead of Thierry Ray, who repeated the feat at 60 kilograms. And on August 2, Parisi added to this gold and silver in the open category. An exemplary athlete in every way, Parisi was chosen to carry the flag for the French delegation at the opening ceremony of the 1984 Olympic Games in Los Angeles. It was incredible. It was as emotional as when I became an Olympic champion. Parisi recalled, I was the first French athlete to enter the Olympic Stadium. It's something I will remember for the rest of my life. Angelo Parisi is also unlikely to forget the heavyweight final in which he faced Japan's Hitoshi Sato. After an evenly matched fight, Parisi managed to take his opponent down just as the gong sounded to end the bout, but alas had to saddle for silver. It was his fourth podium in three Olympic Games, making Angelo the male judoka with the most Olympic medals in history, a record that still stands today. Parisi last competed in 1985, at the age of 32. after which he took up coaching, was the coach of the French national team, where he trained such Olympic gold medalists as Jamal Burris and the legendary Udoka of the 90s. The first double Olympic champion David Doulet, about whom earlier on the channel, I have already made a video. And, for all his merits in judo, in 2010 Angelo Parisi received the ATH Dan, giving him the right to wear a rare red-black belt.